What's up YouTube, this is TechCracker and I'm going to be showing you how to get OpenSSH on your iPod or any iDevice and what it's used for. Now see I installed this theme and it has as a weather widget Riverview and I don't live in Riverview. So what you first need to do is you go on your computer and you install WinSCP on a Windows computer and I'll put that in the description and then on your iPhone or iPod you go into Cydia then search and search for open SSH it's all one word right here and you install and confirm I already have it installed and now back to your computer you open up win SCP and you'll well first install it and you see a screen like this saying host name username password and what you do for the host name is you go into your settings Wi-Fi and on your Wi-Fi network there's a blue arrow right here you click on that blue arrow and you have to just look at the IP address I won't be showing it to you um, because of what's underneath but you just look at the IP and I'll put it in my IP is 192. Dot, wait, sorry 192.168.1.3 yours is going to be different and don't worry about port number username is root and the password is Alpine A L P I N E and you click on save and you save your network and then you just log in and then it's going to be asking you for your password you type Alpine again and now you're in on the right you'll see this is your my iPod and I double click on the the dotted the dotted lines I scroll down to stash double click on stash now you click on the themes folder double click on themes now you have all your themes here on mine I have to look for the weather so it's I flat 2 weather I click on the weather again and now it's, you look for something that looks for configure and it opens up in a text file on this one it requires me to go into to get the weather code so you go into Yahoo weather put in your zip code And on top, on the search, there's some digits at the end of the URL. You copy those digits, and you paste it into where the digits are here. Now, for every theme, it's something different. You have to Google it. On that's how I, that's how you find out how to do it. Or there's a README file. Now it's gonna ask for the password again. Alpine. And now that's it. It's done. You close it. You'll terminate. Now back to here. What you have to do is you have to respring. Now, to respring, if you don't have S, um, SB settings, you just go into select themes and you have something already. So just like that. you click it twice, you go back, and there's a respring right on top on Winterboard. Let it respring, and when it's back, it'll, it'll say New York, where I live, and that's it. That's how you do it. All right, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.